Hallelujah to Jesus. We give God a praise. Let God be magnified forever in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Hallelujah. Glory to Jesus. This is God's own channel with Evangelist Sarah. You are welcome. The Lord bless you. The Lord bless every member of this household. It is well with you, Jesus. Love you. And I love you. Please, family, like this video, share, subscribe. Tell somebody about this ministry. God bless you as you do that in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Hallelujah. Glory to Jesus. Glory Abba Father. To this person, they did a very heavy witchcraft against you. And I'm going to tell you the symptoms as the Lord is revealing to me right now. So that if you have been experiencing this which I'm going to mention, we can hold hands together and pray. Holding hands together and pray is not just enough. But you have to stay in prayers of warfare. You know what is prayer of warfare? Prayers of warfare. I am not saying that entertaining prayer, entertainment prayer. Oh Lord, let this witch just leave me alone now. Nah, what have I done? You move on. No. You have to stand your ground. Because the witches does not even consider your... Is he... Um, they don't consider your weakness. They don't consider if you are weak or you are not. They don't consider that. When you are even weak, they are very happy. They are very happy. So this is why before I go deep into this message, I want to encourage you. You can even get some prayer point, warfare prayer point. Yes. You don't have maybe to lock yourself up 10 hours to know you are praying. You can continue to pray this prayer point. Prayers every time. Prayers every time. It becomes a part of you. Gradually, gradually, gradually. You need to understand that a journey of a man, a mind started with a step. So when you see somebody that is praying fire, fire, you have to know that they started somewhere. And they started one day. Gradually, 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 gradually. And they got to where they are today. And they still have somewhere to get to tomorrow if the Lord tarries. And they still continue. Child of God, they did a heavy witchcraft against you. To this person, this is the symptoms that you have been having. Suddenly, somebody will just like you. They will just like you. Even if it's your boss, anybody at all, they will just like you. Like Just like you. Show you likeness. They just like you. But suddenly, that likeness just disappear. Like people who are supposed to love you started hating you. <laughs> Let me make me clear. You have had failed friendship, many failed relationships, many failed partners, many failed, 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 this, failed, this, failed, this, failed, this. Something is not right. Is it that you are not lovable? You are lovable. But this is what I'm hearing right now. This is what the Lord is saying. The heavy witchcraft, it is to make sure that nobody sees you, love you for whom you are, and appreciates you for who you really are. You are doing so much, but it looks as if you are doing nothing at all. You are giving so much, it looks as if you are not giving at all. You are, I don't know, you know, there are people who are not even doing as much as you do. They are well loved, they are well appreciated. They are well loved, they are well appreciated. They are well loved, they are well appreciated. A heavy witchcraft was done to sow a seed of hatred in the heart of those who really want to love you. I am not talking about people that live because they were an enemy or because they never wanted to support you. These are people who really wanted to be by your side. People who really want to be by your side. People who really want to be by your side. I repeat again. I repeat again. Now they don't even know why they left you. They don't even know why they don't want that partnership with you anymore. 
they don't even know why they, they just leave you like that. They themselves cannot explain. These are the type of people I'm talking about. Somebody that left you, if you ask them why they do leave, they don't have a reasonable anything. They don't even hate you. They don't even know why. They ended their relationship. They don't know why. I am not saying those that ended it out of envy, hatred, because you were doing well, because God was using you, because you were being blessed, because you were being prospering. But this set I am talking about are the ones that cannot even give a reason. And they can only tell you that they wish you well. But they don't just know what happened. They tell you, forget about their business. Forget about their job. Oh, forget about the promotion, forget about the business, forget about the relationship, forget about the promises, failed promises, failed promises. Not that there are not people who can help you, but every one of them that promise, they keep failing. Child of God, wake up. This is a warfare ministry. Yes, wake up. Wake up. Wake up. It is time to destroy that heavy witchcraft now that makes people to don't want to work with you you have a business idea nobody's interested you want to build a house nobody's even interested you want to start up a ministry nobody's interested and you ask them why are you not interested they don't even have a reason they don't jealous of you they don't hate you they don't have a reason oh i am leaving you why are you leaving no reason Great people come to your way. Suddenly, they just live like that. Great promises come your way. Suddenly, they just come. Who have done this, God? Ah, the wickedness of man. The wickedness of man. The Bible says, let the wickedness of the wicked. Let it come to an end. You see, one of the reasons why they keep reporting my ministries because they know messages like this, they don't want people to hear. No, why would they hear and be delivered? What if they hear and they got delivered? They will want to do everything possible to block them. Not to hear what God is saying. Ah, child of God, that heavy witchcraft that was done against you, by the fire of the Lord, it shall scatter. You know, I have, God has helped me to that level where when I hear messages like this, I am not, I'm not going to stand and say, hey, be afraid, oh, eh, they did worthy witchcraft, oh, oh, run away. No, it's to face it. It is to face it and bring down that witchcraft, that heavy witchcraft. No matter how heavy the witchcraft is, the blood of Jesus is more powerful than it. That by the blood of Jesus from today, as I pray for you, everyone that the Lord have assigned to love you in this life, they will love you genuinely. And every heavy witchcraft that was, that was done against you be scattered by fire. And I pray from today, everyone that the Lord have assigned to come and help you, as they promise you the help, they will truly come and help you. They will truly come and they will help you. You will be helped by God. You will be helped by men. Wherever you need help, you will be helped. That witchcraft pot be broken by fire. The witchcraft pot, you know, this is the kind of prayer I love to pray in my warfare prayer session. That witchcraft pot be broken by fire. <clears throat> yes, the witchcraft pot, it is broken by fire. Hallelujah. Every heavy witchcraft that was done against you, it is reversed now. Yes, that heavy witchcraft that was done against you, it is reversed now. I am praying for somebody. That heavy witchcraft that was done against you at the sound of your amen, it is reversed now. I pray for you from today. Anyone that come across your path that love you will walk with you in love. In the name of Jesus. 
It is well with you, Jesus. Love you. And I love you with the love of Christ. I am your sister, Evangelist Sarah, by the grace of God. I will see you again. Bye-bye.